Macan is one of the sportiest SUVs in its segment. This vehicle ultimately benefits from unbeatable proportions. For us as the designers, the Macan obviously gives us the perfect template for designing a beautiful car because it showcases the entire breadth of the Porsche DNA. In general, the car has a very clean design. We really focused on the front and rear design of the new Macan. Ultimately, we wanted to ensure that the vehicle still looks like it's been made from a single piece. A large central air intake is characteristic of the Macan concept. As you would expect, this feature also provides a very potent focal point at the front of the new vehicle. But a completely new element is the more technical look of the lateral air intakes. The design is now more rational, like on a racing car. The vertical line here is more prominent and enables this fantastic floating effect here. We now have this really attractive front light module that gives the vehicle a really modern look here at the front. New technologies give us designers the opportunity to devise ever more precise signatures that complement the exterior design. The LED standard headlights showcase the Porsche 4-point daytime running light in its purest form. We've created a really interesting interplay of surfaces here at the front of the interior panel, and the compact module frames the whole lot beautifully. These four points present the daytime running light, and then the lens in the center generates the dipped beam and high beam. The entire design comes across as very compact, featuring self-contained, simple shapes with a sophisticated finish. The PDLS headlight is our high-tech masterstroke. We've developed the four-point signature to create these three-dimensional lines that draw backwards. The overall effect is sharper and more striking, creating a very determined look that extends across the vehicle. The dipped beam in the PDLS headlight is created by these four elements here. It's similar to the daytime running light. This design allows us to bring the four points of the typically Porsche lighting signature to the road at night too. Our focus for the interior design of the new Macan was obviously to ensure that it looks like a genuine Porsche. For us, this meant decisions like aligning the dashboard horizontally, as you can see here. This feature beautifully emphasizes the width and delivers an uncluttered finish. The driver's attention should be on the road, after all. The element that really makes this vehicle a Macan is the fact that the design is fundamentally more robust. You can see this here at the doors, but also in this section on the passenger side. The design is really three-dimensional, with prominent decoration in the form of this beautiful highlight frame that surrounds the screen. We've added a completely new infotainment system on a wide 11-inch display. The new screen also gave us the scope to do something slightly different with other elements of the design. The air vents now sit lower down, but this gives us more space for the display itself and operation. We've also added some great little details to the air vents. Here are the little loops, as we call them. This detail also links with the emphasis on width that we like to achieve in Porsche interiors. Obviously the colors, but also the high quality finish of the materials are essential for a striking design in the interior. As you would expect, these choices were made with the aim of adding bold touches to the design of the new Macan. The new Macan showcases its Porsche design DNA most effectively and most obviously at the rear. The rear of the vehicle now features a light strip. This new element has now become an integral part of the brand identity for us. It's a new look that works really well with this clean design in my opinion. But then here we've treated the cover glass to maintain one of the features typical of the Macan design, essentially redefining the product DNA of the Macan. The movement across the cover glass on the vehicle is really quite intense, as you can see here. The first element is the tail light strip, which extends across almost the entire width of the vehicle with a homogeneous design. 
The second element is the ribbed section, which you can see here on the outer section of the light module. These precise chiseled lines again emphasize the vehicle width, and the more you study them, the better they look. The four-point brake light mirrors the four-point daytime running lights at the front. This really slim strip that you can see here, four on each side, is enclosed in a sandblasted glass unit that glows in the background. The slim hockey stick shape of the indicator traces the bottom edge of the light module. We also have these fine lines at the top of the indicator and this layered sail-like element at the front. These features continue the illumination. These aspects of the design invite you to get closer and really study this detail. As designers, we know that we've done a good job when the visual connotations and the technical characteristics of a vehicle work this well together. I genuinely think that no other SUV out there is cooler than this one.